and welcome to my channel um in this video i'm going to be sharing with you how i made this beautiful headband with a twist and one of the great things and one of the things i like about this headband is that it allows me to wear my wig without any glue this is a wig a braided wig and uh, i didn't apply any glue and this is how it looks as you can see so let's get right into the video please don't forget to subscribe like this video if you found it useful thank you so i have two pieces of this type of fabric and i'm going to put the name in the description box so each of them is 21 centimeter long and six sorry inches and six inches wide and my fabric is a stretchy type and it's such that it stretches in one direction so i did cut along the part that is stretchy as you can see the width is along that part that is stretchy the next thing for me to do is to take each of them put the two right sides together as you can see and i'm going to pin this down and then i'm going to sew on the wrong side i'm going to, i'm doing this for each of the piece as you can see i'm just going to sew a straight line of about half an inch please don't forget to like this video subscribe to this channel i promise to bring better co more content across your way so having done that the next thing for me to do is i'm going to turn this inside out to the right side i'm doing this for each of the piece that i've joined together and then i'm going to lay them flat in a cross like manner just watch what i'm doing so i'm doing i'm just turning this other piece too to the right side and then i'm going to lay bring just bring one of the any of them with the wrong side of where the seam line is showing and then take the one end to meet the other and then do the same for the other type so that would form the twist in front of the headband so I'm going to pin the two sides together, pin the first, the right side together, the two pieces on the right side, and then I'm going to pin the two pieces on the left side together as well. And I'm going to sew the band. I'm just going to finish up by sewing my band um, such that the seam is inside. You see what I mean by that? So I'll bring the two sides together and then bring the two middle, middle pieces together from each side. And then I'm going to sew um so about half an inch as well just watch me two pieces together the inner side to form the inner part of my headband and then i'm just going to sew about half an inch together i've done that and then i'm going to sew the outer part bring the two uh, remaining piece on these two sides together flip over to bring the two right sides together such that the wrong sides are the one facing the outer part as you can see and then I'm going to do the same thing I did to the other part of my headband. I'm just going to take in about half an inch as well. And so now I didn't have to an allowance because um, this fabric is stretchy and it would fit um, even a bigger head circumference. So there was no need for me to have any sewing allowance. So I've just done that. So here is my headband. The last thing for me to do is to open up my seam. As you can see so that it's flat just open up open them and then do the same for both both the inner and the outer um, part of the headband bring them together to lift as they are laying flat and then sew right in the middle in a way that the stitch is almost invisible to the eyes so i'm going to do that just now i've done that off camera as you can see and this, my stitch is almost invisible to the eyes um so the last thing for me to do is just to open that and then trim away the excesses I've done that already off camera and my band is ready. Please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.